fall on. If y'all don't start commenting and sharing and subscribing, it's going to be me and y'all. Yeah. Stop playing with me. Comment. Hello, my fault. Go to the video. Hello. Bring some of that royalty. So guess what? We finally, finally, finally dropped the website. You dig what I'm saying? <laughs> Listen, y'all make sure y'all tap in, man. Crown Creators Academy, the link will be in the description. These are my tiers of the YouTube coaching. You do not have to ask me anymore what the cost is. Here we go. You will also be on the Crown Insider if you become the, uh, you know, my, my, my student of the week. Hello, my student of the month. <laughs> This is my own digital magazine, The Crown, The Insider, all right? I also have merch for y'all. Give me a damn second. What the goddamn hell, yeah? Honey Sauce, which is one of my favorite designs on this website. You dig what I'm saying? And a uh, good goddamn deal. You dig? This website is very, very, very descriptive. You can go and find anything that you need and all information as well. Also, if you need body butter, make sure you tap in with my Honey Sauce. <laughs> Emerald Zaddy is for the more uh, androgynous, for the more masculine, uh, you know, made sure we had a little cologne type, uh, you know, thing for y'all. But also we have the glow. You dig what I'm saying? Body, body cream and also the candy margarita as well. And ladies, you don't have to get it in your nails. My baby got spoons for y'all. You dig what I'm saying? She got spoons. All right. So y'all make sure y'all tap in. I love y'all so much. Links will be in the description. Enjoy the video. Yiddy. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Neek G, the host, and today I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying and what the goddamn hell your league. So, CJ So Cool, baby mama Nike calls out royalty after Neek, bef Neek boyfriend Dwayne Bacon... Mr. Bacon clears up rumors. Be ready for Ramadan and you're ready to respond to you're bent over covering your poop poom in your profile pit talking about ready for Ramadan. So Ruby Rose ended up changing her profile pit after being called out. Y'all leave y'all comments down below when it comes to that. Now in my previous video, Jordan That's Deshay right. Frost X was upset that TikTok keep tagging Deshay in her comments. Well, they ran into each other recently after that video. <laughs> Smooth criminal. Double up. Double up. You know he had to cover it. No, don't, Alan, don't post that. All this is too late. Oh my it's God. Hard. No! It's live. Alan, what do I, I'll pay you more than what he paid you for the month. In she my capping. previous video, I reported that multiple companies are reaching out to Kai after he hit number one on Twitch and he won Streamer of the Year award. So DDG is also interested in signing Kai. I was excited to do Zooted. Would you like make sure like I get like like everything goes right? No. Yeah. Um, your shit go gold. I just send you the link so you can buy it. Uh -huh. If you come to Zooty, I can send you the link so you can buy it yourself. Buy what? Buy your own plaque. Well, I could buy a plaque. Yeah, you can buy your plaque once it go gold. Like I'm um, saying, if you sign the suited and then you went gold, I just have you buy your own plaque type shit. I'm not. We don't. We don't provide that service. Uh -huh. you, know what I'm you know. Yeah, but you still. You know. Yeah. Good. Yeah, we give you good. God, just hang up on him. Know, yeah, I just want to make sure that you know everything's going right and shit. Yeah, no, it's good. How Chris? How Chris? Deal been going? Oh, he going. He going good. He he on his. He already turned in five albums. He got about ten thousand to go. So <laughs> <laughs> he almost done though. <laughs> so Nike called out Roti for copying her hairstyle. Nike posted her IG. She said, baby, the shit is getting sick. I can't even make this up. I'm glad I get my hair braided tomorrow. Have it, Booski. People will follow you just to see what you're doing, not how you're doing. And Roti clapped back. She said, stop tagging me and what a lame did after me because you ain't create shit. Keep scrolling right. on my timeline so you can keep up. Then she showed the date of the picture, which was February 19, 2020. And Nike came back with a picture from 2013. She Girl. said, show me something older than this and I'll shut the fuck up. Nah, that's mean? crazy. <laughs> Your average Leo, you go low, baby. I'm going to hell if we go on somewhere, okay? 
If we not, fuck you. Oh, but baby, if we going somewhere, we going to hell. I promise you. Girl, <laughs> 2013 is crazy. I mean, what the fuck? Catch up. Y'all leave y'all comments down below when it comes to that. But let's talk that about was Mr. 10 Biggie, years ago. A lot of y'all was hitting me up wondering who that mystery woman was in the background, which we eventually found out that was his mom in the background. <laughs> Keep in mind, I'm sent this information. I have to report on it because this is my job. But I do appreciate y'all for correcting me in the comments. I love y'all. As well as y'all correcting me on Dwayne's Bacon comment. Now, I didn't know that Nick responded back to the comment. I just know that she deleted the comment. And maybe she deleted the comment because she didn't like what people were saying underneath the comment because a lot of people were dragging him previously because he deleted her pictures when they broke up so maybe she's trying to avoid people being in her relationship now by keeping it private because they still not follow each other on social Ain't media now, Mr. Bacon recently did shit. go live to address some things and here's what he had to say i think that's the like the, it's not hard maintaining maintaining a relationship that far away when you genuinely you know, love and i and cannot it. watch him for seven minutes we got seven minutes of this Oh, no. Nah. And you care for somebody. Y'all got two more minutes like, for my shit here, eight minutes. <laughs> the relationship is the easy part to me. Of mm -hmm. course, everybody going to go through stuff, but the relationship is the easy part. Like, because I know I'm, I go, I know when she come, like, it's like we are separable. And when I go, I th we talk about it a lot. It's easy for us to like be away from each other because you got so many. It's only a certain amount of years I can still play basketball, right? I can still play basketball. So if I'm overseas, say six or seven more years, shit, I'm only 34, <laughs> and she's only 30. So you got to think about from us, from her 30. 30 she's 30. Nick is 30 years old. <clears throat> Ain't no way Nick 30 years old. 30 and I'm 34. Like, man, we got a whole month. I mean, he should know his girlfriend's birthday, but I'm just saying. We like to live. Like, you feel me? I didn't think she was a 30. She like 27. She's still young as hell. So Ain't she? It's like. He must have rounded that. Much because we like, I feel like. In seven years. Right side of us oh, okay. just staying together so damn long. Like, yeah, okay. You 30 by the time I'm done. and I'm So she like 23, 24. Day. Like, that's, that's the uh -huh. difference. Like, and he's 24, not, 25. Like, that's the only reason okay. I get on him. I don't say nothing. Oh, about. well, no, he like 27, 28. Mm -hmm. That lady, because y'all know how I feel about that lady, bro. I'm not, I don't hide my emotions. I don't hide my feelings. I don't hide none of that shit. Like, bro, y'all stop asking me about her. I'm a grown man. I was a grown man before I met her. She's a, a grown woman. She was a grown woman before we met who before she met me. But y'all know how I feel. Like, leave that where it's at. Y'all, he love that woman. Leave it alone. All right, y'all. We done with this video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Good at the bye.